Hi, welcome to our video. Today I'm very excited to show you this new rugged phone from Rugex. Now, Rugex is a trusted UK brand in rugged phones and tablets. This is their latest model in the Rhino range. It's called the Rhino 6 and it's a fantastic new phone in our opinion. Now, being a Rugex, it is tough, it's dustproof, it's shopproof and it's waterproof too. Rugex, in our view, make the best rugged phones and tablets. Now, let's have a look on the outside of this phone. This phone has a lovely 5-inch screen. It has a front-facing camera. It had the touch buttons on the bottom. On the side, it's got a SOS and PTT button. We'll go over that later. It's got magnetic charging port on the side. And it's got a micro USB port on the bottom. It's got a volume rocker and a power button on the other side. And it's got a headphone jack on the top. On the back, we've got the back main camera. We've got a speaker grill and a lanyard slot there. So you can stick a lanyard or strap in there. We've obviously got the camera and flash. We've got this textured finish on the back, which gives it a little bit more grip. So it's not going to slip out of your hand. The Rhino range all has this sort of metal sides to give it a bit more strength and structure as well. So as with all the Rhino range, you've got the metal sides as well. It just makes that phone a little bit more stronger. As you can see, it's a quite a handsome looking phone. It's relatively big and bulky as well. Being a rugged phone, it's going to be a bit bigger. Now, I'll show you how to take the battery out and put the SIMs in. So you just need to unscrew two screws, pop the back off like so, take the battery out like so, and then you've got your memory card slot it can take up to 128 gigabytes micro sd memory card slot it just goes there and then it can take two micro sims which is that size and not the small nano sims it's a micro sim the middle size if you like and it can take two it can take one 4g stroke 3g sim and one 2g sim you don't have to have two sims at the same time you can just use one it doesn't make a difference and then to put it all back together, just put it all back together like that and screw it up. Right, let me show you the waterproof test. Now, if you're going to do this, please make sure the uh, the back cover is screwed on properly. The headphone jack and the micro USB uh, port on the bottom are actually waterproof. So unlike other phones, you don't need a rubber port to protect them. They are waterproof. So that's a bonus specifically on this phone so you can see I can dump it in the water wiggle it about and things and it's going to be absolutely fine now it's IP68 rated so it can go into a meter deep of water for up to 30 minutes so that's the highest IP rating that you can get and this has it now bear in mind because um, the headphone jack is exposed you may have a little bit of water in there you may need to wait for it to dry out if you're going to do this but I suggest you don't do this because you don't really need to right let me show you what it comes with it comes with a USB charging cable it comes with a magnetic charger adapter so you can use the side magnetic charging port and put your USB port a uh, USB charger in there and it's just easier to charge because you don't have to line it up. You can put it in any direction. So that's good. You get a, a pair of headphones as well. You can make calls and listen to music with that headphone. And we are going to throw in this free plug, um, free of charge for a limited time as well. And of course you get the quick start manual too. Right, let me show you how it operates. Now, being an Android, you've got uh, everything that any Android phone has. You've got your desktop, you've got the notifications at the top, you've got the Play Store and things. We 
where you can download games, moves, m movies, music, books. It's very important to have the Play Store. It's really everywhere you download everything from your apps and things. Obviously, it's got a browser. You can download your own browser. Let's just show you how quick the internet is. This is on Wi-Fi at the moment, so it's fairly quick. But I just want to show you the screen, really. So you can see with this lovely 5 inch screen it's nice and um, clear, bright and vibrant and the text is very easy to read. Of course you've got pinch to zoom and things. Being a nice capacitive multi-touch screen it's got that pinch to zoom which uh, makes life a lot easier. So you've got your touch buttons on the bottom, you've got your back, your home and your mem uh, menu button or recent apps button. In the middle you've got your app tray button, that's where all your apps live. Now we went back to these two buttons here. Let me show you how they work. They're both programmable. So you program them by going into down here where it says one key SOS and the left and down so the left up and down will program those buttons so the left up which is the top button basically you can use it to link to any app that you like so if you press that you can link, link it to what app, whatever app you want to open so at the moment Let's put it on phone. So if I press that button, the phone dialer will open up. So if I show you the up button there, there you go, the phone dialer opens up. Of course, you can set that to any app or any function that you like. Now, let's do the left down button. So let's turn that on. And we'll put that to the one key SOS. Then we need to go up and we need to set up the one key SOS. Now from here we can tell it to call or text, actually text a specific contact. So if you're in trouble, it will text that specific contact, please help me, and text them your time, the date, and your GPS coordinates. So that's quite useful if you need it. Of course I can get that set up to something else, particularly like Zello. So Zello is like a walkie-talkie app. So I can use that to open up Zello and use it as a Zello push to talk button. So to set that up, I go here, set up the desired button and press that. And that will be now my Zello push to talk button. Let me show you how it works. Testing, one, two, three. Testing one two three. Testing one two three. Okay, the other thing I'd like to show you how loud this uh, speaker is on this phone. Now, obviously, being a rugged phone, having a loud speaker is pretty important. There you can see it's pretty loud. Now I want to show you the ringtones as well. Now having a loud ringtone is quite uh, important for this type of phone because you may work in a loud environment so this is important for you. Let me show you this uh, beautiful screen. Now this screen obviously is a 5 inch screen and it's great for watching YouTube videos, movies and it's just a lovely screen to consume media on. So photos and things will show up nice and clear. Look at the vibrant colours on this picture, this screen is superb.
for viewing back pictures and you can see how vibrant all those colors are it truly is a a wonderful screen so let's uh, see it from different angles as well we can obviously pinch to zoom look at the detail of that screen it's got good resolution again if we see it from different angles it doesn't lose any of that vibrancy and it's good in all angles which is important as well okay let's show you the camera now the camera on this is on the back of it the main camera is a 13 megapixel camera and as you would expect with all smartphones and things you've got plenty of settings in there to do videos and pictures and things like that so let me take a picture of my monkey man here and we'll have a look at the results so let me take a couple of pictures and and then you can have a look at it now if i zoom in you can see it's pretty good picture it captures a lot of detail in there and it's a nice picture as you'd expect now being a waterproof phone you'll be able to take videos like this that like I've done here which is nice as well right I want to show you this glove mode that has now providing you've got relatively thin gloves like I've got here you can use this providing you turn the glove mode on now obviously you saw there it didn't work with my gloves on now to turn the glove mode on I just go to the glove mode turn it on and then like I said if you have reasonably thin gloves like I've got here I'll be honest you need thin gloves you can use it so you can see when I had the glove mode off you could not use it at all with those gloves now that I've turned the glove mode on it turns up the sensitivity somewhat so you can use glove mode let me show you once I've turned it off it's just completely unresponsive right finally what I'd like to show you obviously you may not be into games but this is just to show you that this phone is pretty powerful and it's pretty capable it's got a very good processor it's got plenty of RAM it's got plenty of storage and it's got a dedicated graphic CPU so it can handle games should you want to play games Okay, so let's wrap this up. Now, this phone is made by Ruggix. Ruggix is a UK trusted brand in rugged phones and tablets. This model is their Rhino 6 model, and it comes with some fantastic specs. Not only has it got a, a great octa core CPU, so it processes in things really fast, it's got 3 gigs of internal RAM, so you can have more things open at the same time. It's got 32 gigs of internal memory, which is upgradable with a micro SD card, 228 gig, so you've got plenty of storage options there you've got the front facing camera and you've got a back facing camera 13 megapixel which is really good for for that camera you've got the programmable buttons which are really useful um, so if you're using work applications you can quickly opening open them by mapping those applications to those buttons of course you can use it for push to talk uh, with apps like Zello and you can map those buttons to that and of course you can use it as an SOS button should you need to. Now other phones also come with uh, waterproof rubber ports so your headphone port and your micro USB port is protected. Now this doesn't need it because it's got fully waterproof headphone port and a micro USB port so it really saves some time where you don't have to open and close them and possibly damage them as well it also comes with that magnetic charging port on the side as well so you can stick that little adapter onto your USB cable and then it doesn't matter which orientation the charger goes into you're not going to damage your phone I do actually recommend charging it that way it's a lot more easier and it's no fuss whatsoever so there you have it guys this phone is a superb phone if you need a tough phone with a large 5 inch screen with really good specs this is the phone for you I really highly recommend it 
Thanks very much for watching our video and I hope you choose to buy this phone soon.